police spotted a suspicious vehicle and they stopped the vehicle. As they stopped the vehicle, two individuals fled from the vehicle. One started heading west, the second one started heading east. A Milwaukee police officer with six years experience started chasing the individual who was running to the east. He ordered that individual to drop his gun. The individual did not drop his gun, held the gun, or I shouldn't say, I don't know that for a fact, but had the gun with him, uh, and the officer fired several times. The individual was hit in the chest and hit in the arm. He was hit by two bullets, one in the chest, one in the arm. That individual, it's a 23-year-old man, has died. Two police officer, I mean, two police vehicles um, also had their windows broken out. Um, there was a, an individual, a police command staff in one of those individuals, he was not injured. There was, however, a police officer who was injured um, when a windshield was broken, presumably in the second car. I don't know that for sure. That officer is now in the hospital. I believe that officer has a head injury. I don't know how serious that injury is. As you all saw, the crowd then went over to the gas station uh, and set the gas station afire. I don't know how many individuals were involved in that. Of course, that's going to be part of the investigation as well.